Hardcore Addicts, welcome back to another Crew 2 video. This will be customizing and taking a look at the brand new Volkswagen 21 window bus in the Crew 2. This one is brand new, released today, July 15th, 2020. It is part of the Summer in Hollywood update. So very cool, a very um, desirable vehicle uh, for collectors. It's uh, <laughs> very interesting and different to say the least, and there's many different variants and stuff out there. I mean, this thing was pretty much converted into anything you can think of, a camper, a tow truck, a pickup truck. I mean, there's just there's a lot of different variants, and people have done crazy things with them. But they're very cool, and, and there's something very special about them. And there's so many different versions. Um, this, this, for example, is the 21 window version. There was a 15 window, an 11 window, a 23 window. There's like a bunch of different ones, but this is the 21 window. And over here, of course, we have the... Volkswagen Beetle across from it there, or the Bug. Uh, these two pretty much came out with the same update, but they gave us this one a little earlier for some reason. But anyways, let's go ahead and get right into it. And also, when we take it outside, we're going to do a stock top speed run, even though that's not what this is made for, but might as well for fun. And then a maxed out top speed run with double nitrous. The Beetle did about 249 with double nitrous, maxed out, kind of pushing it. Uh, this thing, who knows, if it gets over 200 miles an hour maxed out, I'll be happy. I mean, imagine a big, something this big, a VW bus flying by you doing over 200 miles an hour. I think that's kind of funny. So, alrighty, let's get right into the manufacturer colors. So we got the red, the dark red, you know, like an orange, yellow, a lot of different crazy colors here. Very cool. So I'm going to be going with like a metallic, uh, like a bright blue. Do something like this. That looks nice. I'm gonna do that. All right, and the community has gotten really creative with deliveries. I just kind of scrolled by here just so you can kind of see what people have been doing. Mystery machine. <laughs> I mean, people with school bus. People have gotten crazy doing different things, and then you have this one right here. Um, no comment there. <laughs> And, you know, people have gotten pretty crazy with all the different options and stuff like that. So, uh, moving on to the visual parts. Front bumper. We have the headlight option, similar to the Beetle. Um, a lot of the options for the bus are very similar to the Beetle. And if you've seen that video or you've customized it yourself, you'll kind of see the pattern here. Then you have, like, the modern lights, which I think I'm going to go with the modern lights this time, just to kind of... Give it some modern hints, you know, not not overkill, but just some modern some modern hints here and there. Or touches, I should say. So this one deletes the front bumper. And it gives you like a, a very smooth front bumper with like a little fog light at the bottom. And then this one gives you the stock one in chrome. This one gives you a very smooth front bumper. And a chrome version of that. And then very like flush chin front splitter, I guess you could say, or very smooth front bumper, which does look pretty good. But I feel like it's too flat at the front with that. It looks kind of like a real bus, like a like a tour bus or something. Um, so I definitely want to try to keep like a bumper on there. And I think I'm going to go with the smooth one with the modern lights. I think that's like a nice happy medium and it looks pretty good. So let's do that. Oh, the upgrades are really cheap on this thing. 223 bucks. Front fenders. So this one kind of like gives you, I don't know why it zooms like that, but this one kind of gives you like a fender, it kind of lifts it a little bit too. It is a little weird, kind of like a truck. And I would have done it, but when we get to the back, you'll see that it does look weird. Um, so I'm not gonna put it for now. When we get to the rear fender, you'll see why. Got the wheels. Now, I feel like it's a crime to change these wheels on this specific vehicle, so <laughs> I'm gonna leave these. Uh, they look pretty cool. Caliper color, you can't see it, but whatever. Make it blue. I guess when the mechanic takes off the cover, I'll have a little surprise. <laughs> Side mirrors, we have the stock ones. You can do these, they're a little more smaller. And you have these here, which are like a, a little bit more modern. Um, I'm gonna go with these. Side skirts, you have like the stock chrome piece there. And you, here you have a side step. And here you have a smooth piece, which I do like a lot. But the chrome is pretty nice as well. But this one does come down a little further. I kind of like that. We'll do that. Might as well. Rear fender. Here's what I was talking about earlier. Look at that. That's. 
that's a little excessive. The height there is a little bit much, but if you want to kind of make the two fenders match, I guess this is like your option. And the option after this is a little wider than that. So, you know, fully up to you, but personally, I love the way it, you know, tucks and all that. that that's like the purpose of this. It was designed that way. I why so many people like it because of all the special things it has. So, I kind of feel like getting rid of that is a not really that, that cool a thing. It's like a big shame to do that, in my opinion. But, rear wing. So, this thing does have spoiler options. Very <laughs> strange, but first one here. Is not too bad. It looks kind of like a kind of like a ducktail option. Next one gets a little crazier. See that there, and then from here on out it just gets uh, <laughs> interesting. Fast and Furious Volkswagen bus. Yeah, a little a little crazy there. Um, I, I guess I'll just throw this one on there just because you know whatever. Uh, but I'll probably take it off later. But we'll just throw it on there. Rear bumper. So the stock rear bumper of this thing is pretty cool. You got the little VW mud flaps of the way that looks. So here you have different uh, light options and vents options combined. And then here you have a smooth, smoother rear bumper. And here you have this chrome one with the exhaust. And here you have primary smooth. And here you have a smooth chrome with the uh, side exhaust that looks pretty cool a little bit like a modern touch to it makes you definitely think that it's definitely modified in there <laughs> got these and then the single exit craziness back here <laughs> and those are the options there so i'm gonna go i think i'm gonna go for this one this exhaust one it makes it makes you think like it's crazy modified under there and i kind of like that um and then i'm gonna go with the the modern lights a little bit more modern, like tinted there. I wonder if those are, those are LED. I guess we'll see when we go outside. Interior color. So this is this one's actually pretty fun. We'll go back up here. You have red, light brown, dark brown. You have the gray, you got cream, silver, the blue, and then the yellow. So I'm gonna go blue, but I'm gonna tone it down. So first tone down makes it two tone black and blue. And then the last one is like a cream with the outer and blue, which I love. So I'm definitely going to do that. Interior materials, there are none. And then interior insert, it's all, you know, stock. But here you can get a good glimpse of the detail in here. I mean, they did a phenomenal job. Very, very well done. Let's see how that looks all together. <laughs> That's awesome. Not bad at all. Um, as far as the vanity, you know, with all these vehicles are all available here if you want to throw one of those on there. Uh, tire smokes and nitrous colors under crazy underglow and uh, tints, which the tints is not too bad, but I don't want to put tints on that. I kind of want to keep that interior showing off, you know, but, you know, it's all personal preference and different horns and stuff. So as far as the performance, obviously this is not a performance vehicle, but we're going to mess around with it and see what we can do. All right, let's throw a brake upgrade on here just so we can kind of expand the stats. There we go, 78 mile an hour top speed, 47 horsepower. <laughs> oh, look at that, 0 to 60 in 19 seconds. 19 seconds, you don't see that every day. That's, oh my gosh, 19 seconds, 0 to 60. Wow, that's, that's 20 second quarter mile. I think this might be the slowest vehicle in the game. That's... That is hilarious. Well, it's definitely going to be interesting when we max it out. Let's go back to stock. Perf level 10. Alrighty, let's let's drive this. Um, this should be interesting. Oh, yeah, the back ones are modern. Look at that. We got our front ones modern, too. That was a nice... That's cool. I like that. That was a good choice. Alright, see how it sounds. <laughs> Oh my gosh, from the inside. <laughs> it backfires too. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, let's go for it. This is full throttle. That's full throttle. <laughs> We're gonna get there eventually. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thankfully, we don't drive that far in these uh, videos when you go to the top speed location, but that is. That's hilarious. Uh, up, uphill. Look at it. It's struggling going uphill. It's going down. <laughs> the speed's going down. Oh my gosh. We're, we're, 
We've had it floored the entire time, but we're still doing 50 miles an hour. Okay, we're getting 60. All right, now we're going downhill. 66. 70. There we go. It's moving now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy cow. Oh, jeez. 77. 80. 80. Not bad. Oh my gosh. All right. Let's uh let's do a top speed run here. Um, obviously all vehicles in this game come with nitrous stock, and we're gonna um, use that at the very end of our run. So here we go. back down 83 82 so there you go it barely goes past the highway speed limit <laughs> oh my gosh that's hilarious well then um very interesting uh, now I guess we can try to max it out and see what this thing turns into I'm very very curious to see how fast we get this to go if it goes over 200 miles an hour max out I'll, I'll be happy with it all right let's max it out There we are, maxed out, perf level 20 out of 280, top speed up to 226 miles an hour, over 500 horsepower, <laughs> 0 to 62.5, quarter mile in the nines, and a VW bus, what is going on? See, that's what these upgrades do, and they just <laughs> completely transform these vehicles. This is going to be fun. <laughs> oh boy, alright, let's see how this does. Oh, also, the, you can see with the upgrades, it actually lowered it a bit, which it does look a lot cleaner now. Love that. Alright, here we go. miles an hour in a VW bus. I was happy with 200. 245. That is incredible. <laughs> These things are insane. Unbelievable this game where you can transform any vehicle into a monster. Even a VW bus. And I think that's pretty cool. As far as the handling, let's see here. Oh, not that great. The acceleration is, is okay. The gears are pretty long. The brakes are not that great either. Can't trust the brakes too much. Want it here. Let's take a corner. Oh my. Yeah, not, I mean, obviously it's, it's still an older vehicle even when you have modern parts in it and stuff, but you can still... <laughs> this thing is fun. The nitrous here. <laughs> I just can't believe this thing going this fast, taking corners at this speed. That's so funny. Apex that. <laughs> Not bad at all. First person. I would be very afraid in this thing going over 200 miles an hour. <laughs> oh my god. Well, anyways, guys. This does it is it is pretty cheap. It's twenty two thousand. If you have some upgrades lying around, you know, just to kind of mess around, I think it would be fun. Same thing with the Beetle. These are both 
great to kind of buy mess around with uh, not bad not bad at all let me know what you guys think down below how you would have customized it what you think of the way i customized it hope you guys enjoyed thanks for watching and uh here are all the wheel options or the vw bus if you want to see that i always put that at the end of these videos hope you enjoyed guys and i'll see you next time